Hi everyone, Andy Davis here again from Master of Voice, a channel with reactions to performers from across the world. In this episode, I'm happy to be featuring Demi Lovato as she sang recently on the Grammy Awards in 2020. This is her performance of the song Anyone, and I'm excited to jump right in. <laughs> She's looking beautiful in this dress. For those of you that may not know, this is Demi's first time back to the stage in about a year and a half, maybe even two years, and so this is a much anticipated performance. I'm just excited to see her back up there and doing what she does so well, which is sing and write beautiful songs. And so I know that sometimes it's not great to start over, but I am just glad that she is up there doing this right now. And that's why I'm excited about this. I tried to talk to my piano. I tried to talk to my guitar. Talk to my imagination, confided into alcohol. I tried and tried and tried some more, told secrets till my voice was sore. Tired of empty conversation, cause no one hears me anymore. Wow. I believe she had written this just before her overdose, and I don't know of, if you all know of Demi Lovato or not. She's one of my favorites. I just enjoy so many of her hits over the past, what, decade, I guess, or more. Who, I'm not sure how long she's been on the scene, but she is just a, a great voice, a great belting singer. She pours her heart into it. But she has had a lot of struggle over the years, especially with addiction. And so to see her back on the stage, allowing the world to see her vulnerability after being away from the scene for a while, it's just touching me so much. A hundred million stories and a hundred million songs. I feel stupid when I sing. Nobody's listening to me. But they always get it wrong I feel stupid when I pray I just enjoy this so much But I just wanted to mention vocally here That she starts at a really low end of her register there Nicely supported and focused And then ascends up through a melodic phrase And opens up into a big belting chest voice sound so well done on the breath, so in focus with well-placed vowels, and I know that's not what she's focusing on right now in this performance, but to me, I am impressed as a singer, as a vocalist, and as a fan that she sounds good, y'all. She sounds so good. So why am I praying anyway if nobody's listening? Yes. To me, that is signature Demi through that section. Wide open, big belting chest voice sounds. Well supported, right on the edge just a bit, but to me, that is just the emotion and the passion that's coming out of her soul right now. Oh, I just can't imagine going through what she's gone through just in the past few years and now putting yourself back on the stage for one of the first times 
in this setting, amongst all your peers who are up for all these awards, they're all dressed to the nines, and they know or they've heard what you've been going through. And so to me, this is just so stellar. She is just showing her raw emotions and her raw talent here. An excellent performer. to crave the world's attention I think I cried too many times I just need some more affection anything to get me by a hundred million stories and a hundred million songs I feel stupid when I sing great lyrics nobody's listening to me nobody's listening I took to shooting stars but they always get it wrong I feel stupid when I pray Why the hell am I praying anyway If nobody's listening It takes a lot of nerve to To put your life on display like this This song is basically about what she was going through at the time When she had the overdose And you know, substance abuse, addiction issues with anything I just, my heart goes out to her. I struggle with them. My family has struggled with them. My friends have struggled with them. Not just drugs and alcohol, anything. And so I get it. And so that's why this song really touches me. And I'm just so proud of her. Anyway. I just, I am so impressed with that big belting section there. You know, a lot of times your emotions can overtake you when you sing and, and some vocal issues can happen, but she is holding this performance together so well, especially after the restart. She's focused. She has given us her raw emotions, but she's being a professional artist, which is what she is, a star. Nobody's listening to me. Nobody's listening. Wow. Beautiful. I am so impressed with that. And just for all the reasons I've already said in this reaction, the lyrics, her vocals, the piano accompaniment was beautiful. The story leading up to this, her re-entry into the music world, if you will, I am truly impressed with this performance. I love her, and I love that she's back and sounding so good, and I hope in a better place. But if she's not, we're going to be here for her as fans as well. And I know that you all may have those people in your life. It may be you, it may be friends and family, but just be there for those people as you can. We can't always fix what's going on, but we can try our best to be there for those people in need. And I thank you all for the kind words and support that you give me. It keeps me going, and I appreciate that so much. And I hope you enjoyed this reaction. If you did, as usual, click like and subscribe and all that. But just be there with your loved ones. Be there with yourself. Celebrate life as you can, and I hope you have a great day.